Asian and Pacific countries are facing increased vulnerability due to climate change, growing population, and economic development. Increase in natural disasters such as earthquake, typhoon, and floods are compelling risk-prone countries throughout this region to build and maintain resilience to such catastrophes. Sendai Framework for Disaster Risk Reduction, DRR, has identified the significant role that information communication technology and space-based technology can play to reduce vulnerabilities and improve resilience. By integrating ICT and SBT tools with National Disaster Risk Management DRM architecture, timely and accurate information can be delivered to relevant communities, individuals, rescuers, and decision makers to save lives and properties at risk. The Asian Development Bank has initiated a technical assistance project for risk-prone countries to strengthen their resilience by applying SBT and ICT tools. The project is funded by the Japan Fund for Poverty Reduction with technical assistance from the Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency and implementation is led by Geoinformatics Center at Asian Institute of Technology. Partners include Asian Disaster Reduction Center, Remote Sensing Technology Center, and GeoThing. Pilot areas in four countries, Armenia, Bangladesh, Fiji, and the Philippines have been selected for this project. The project aims to improve local data collection by introducing ICT tools to local governments and communities. These tools allow decision makers to improve response, recovery, and reconstruction efforts. At the national level, SBT applications have also been introduced for governments to make national plans and quickly assess the damages in case of natural disaster. In order to accomplish this, two mobile applications, GeoMap Tool and GeoBing An, have been developed along with data viewing software, GeoBingAnn.info. The whole process is completed in five steps. One, local community digitizes roads and buildings on OpenStreetMap, which is a global open source map of the world. Two, the base map is created by local community by adding building attributes to the map, such as building condition, height, and building material by using GeoMap tool during the field visits. Three, with the help of DRM specialists, Community Geo record disaster capacities and vulnerabilities by using mobile application GeoBing An. This information is visualized to create community hazard map using the web-based application GeoBingAnn.info. Four. During the disaster, GeoBing AND allows the user to record information, including disaster situation, building damage, and needs assessment using simple drop-down menus to create a report in an offline environment. These reports can be viewed in GeoBingAnn.info by the government officials in order to make timely decision by providing near real-time data from the field. Five. Upon the request of National Disaster Risk Management Offices, emergency observation from satellite data can be acquired. This powerful data allows governments to understand the extent of a disaster. When it is overlaid with community-based maps, damage extents can be estimated. In Bangladesh, the project is implemented by the Department of Disaster Management with the support of local government engineering department. Two pilot areas were chosen for the project, Baraguna, vulnerable to storm surges and cyclones, and Siraj Gunj, vulnerable to flooding. In Baraguna, over 3,000 buildings, and in Siraj Gunj, 2,400 buildings were digitized in OpenStreetMap by volunteers and used GeoMap tool to add building information to the map. Local volunteers, under the supervision of a DRM specialist, use the mobile application GeoBing AND to record vulnerabilities and capacities in their community related to disaster. Volunteers from Upazila Level were successfully trained to use the new ICT tools, demonstrating the potential of their usage for community-level DRR. Using the web platform geobingand.info, this information was combined with drawing tools to create a community-based hazard and evacuation map. This map can be used to identify safe zones for community members to gather while they await evacuation to help Upazilla rescue technicians and community members. 
local communities were further trained to use GeoBing and mobile application to collect crisis mapping information, such as situational reports, needs assessment, and damage reports. Once uploaded to a computer, the Upazilla and DDM officials can use this information to make data-driven decisions about resources, rescue, and rehabilitation. In Siraj Gunj in Baraguna, trained volunteers, union, and Upazilla officials tested the tools in multiple drills. Following the drills, the Upazilla convened to discuss the lesson learned in ways forward. Encouraging results suggest these tools would be integrated in the National Disaster Risk Management Plan to increase resilience in Bangladesh. <laughs>